In this video, we are talking about three LEGO sets that are rumored to be retiring by the end of this year, which we did not think actually were. Let's get into it. Right, so as I touched on, these are three LEGO sets where there has been rumors speculating that they actually could be retiring by the end of this year, which we never thought that they were. And for a couple of reasons, and we're gonna get into it. But the first one we're gonna touch on is this one, as you can see, the Grand Piano. This is set number 21323. This one has 3,662 pieces and it does retail currently for 600 here in Australia. Now why this one is interesting is, along with another one is that this is two, it is one of the two sets of these three that actually did get a price increase in August of this year. Which is like, hmm, well if it got a price increase, doesn't that mean it won't retire? Who knows? We think not that if a, if a set did get a price increase that it won't be retiring, but we don't know that for certain. So who does know? But I'm gonna tell you, um, just talk about what I've heard and from the information I have in front of me. So let's get straight into it. So this set did actually receive a, I think a $70 increase since August here in Australia. Now we're gonna just go touch on, have a look at brick set and see how long this set was actually out for. So it released in August of 2020. And if it does retire by the end of the year, it would have had a little bit more than a two year run time, which for the Lego ideas sets is about average. So. The, um, the shelf life does tee into that. Yes, it could be possible. And the reason why I'm talking about this is because like I have in the last couple of videos, is my local LEGO store have told me they've got a list sent down from LEGO, a retiring list of all these different sets. And I asked a few of them and uh, this one they did say, yes, it's on it, it's retiring. And if we go to um, a site here that's called Bricks Mega Store, this is the um, some of the LEGO, the official LEGO stores here in Australia. Um, as you can see, They've tagged it as retiring soon on here as well. So this is why like, it's just a rumor. I'm not saying it is retiring. I mean, it could be, it is tagged, but it's not tagged on the official Lego website and we haven't heard any other news anywhere else. But maybe that's because Lego are trying to keep it on the down low. Who knows? But I'm just sharing this with, with what I know with you, just in case you did want to buy this set, just to keep your ears open and just to, to keep tabs on these sets, just in case they are retiring. But the Grand Piano, so as I said, if it does retire, it would have had about a two-year run time. It is a set that has had a price increase, so it is going to be interesting to see if any of the sets that have had a price increase do retire. Because if that's the case, then there may be... Because there was a lot on this list. There was a lot of sets, which I didn't believe were retiring, that were on this list. Again, I'm not saying it's true, but if it is, a lot of sets are going to be gone, which are going to surprise a lot of us. Will surprise every single person. But this is one of them, Grand Piano. The second one I want to touch on is the Coliseum. Uh, this is set number 10276, 9,336 pieces. One of the biggest sets ever released. 850. This one did have a, another price increase like the Grand Piano. This had a $100 increase, I believe, here in Australia. So again, who knows? But we're going to just touch on brick set and have a look at the uh, release date. So November 2020, so similar, just over two years of a shelf life, which for these uh, kind of the, um, the LEGO Creator Expert, the building sets, they're all over the shop with their, um, with their shelf life. Some have had really long, some have had um, quite short. So two years, you could say, yes, it is definitely possible. It could be out for two years. And again, Bricks Megastore, tagged as retiring soon. They have said this one. And again, she told me, yep, it's on the list, it's retiring. So again, if you did want to buy this set and you haven't got it yet because you were just waiting, just keep your ears out just in case. I'm not saying it's going to happen, but you never know. And the last one was the police station. Now, I've touched on this in another video. I just want to reiterate that this one here in, here in Australia, it never received a price increase. This has always been 300 bucks retail since it first released back in 2021. This is set number 10278, 2,923 pieces. And brick set, as, you, as I just touched on, January of 2021, this set did release. So if it does retire, it would have had about a, um, you know, a two-year shelf life, which is below average for modulars. They're usually out for three years, if not longer, but they're usually out for three years. So if they do retire this one, this is going to be uh, the second shortest shelf life of any modular ever released next to the uh, the Market Street. So, and then after that's Town Hall, I believe. So if that's the case, it's gonna have a really short shelf life and it's gonna catch a lot of people off guard and similar. Tagged is retiring soon. She told me it's retiring. Um, some interesting news about the modulars actually. If you wanna see a video, let me know about the modulars because 
We didn't think any of retiring, but um, yeah, if this new news is true, you can say goodbye to pretty much all of them. But anyway, so those three again were the Grand Piano, which is possibly rumored to be retiring, the Coliseum, and the Police Station. But let me know down below what you guys think is happening. Do you reckon that this is just fake news, that this is all just to throw us off if they've just got their information wrong? Because the Lego, the, the Lego stores in person, let's be real, the Lego, um, the people that work there, they don't really know what they're talking about. I'm not saying they all don't, but you can ask them a question and it's like, hmm, yeah, no, I know you're wrong. But anyway, are they wrong? Are they correct? Who bloody knows? But just keep tabs on these three sets. Now, if you would like to see another video of another three rumored sets I have asked about and you have information on that could be retiring, let this video hit 100 likes and I'll bring that out to you as soon as I can. But anyway, guys, as I said, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye.